Huh, is this the golden diva thing? Um. Oh. Okay. This better not be a bomb. How do I? What do I do with this? Um. Oh, I guess this is the Golden Diva. Bro, this, sh this guy's tanky. I thought I was out of the range. Okay. Well, at least I know where the Golden Diva is. What's that blue quest over there? Forgotten Tomb, six players. Mm. No. Can I only spend it? Oh, okay. Well, that means I gotta farm this boss later. Here at the Ashura Mirage, which, judging from that, the look of that, I'm guessing this is from the cutscene we saw earlier. Okay, where'd I go from here? What's this? I'm guessing it's nothing. I'm guessing another oh, cinematic. Wow. Is she about to bullet time the curve the where that movie with uh I forgot her name. I think it's Angelina Jolie and that one kid who through the movie try to curve the bullet. Wow, you missed. <sighs> what? 
What's happening? Wasn't the chandelier there? I'm so confused. Did she magically make it spawn? prepared special rooms for each of you mighty warriors please follow me if you will well the dialogue seems to mess up your accommodations to be quite pleasant and peaceful also she's pretty gorgeous <sighs> looks like she saved your skin jewel huh it's your lucky day soha oh it's a that was the name she was mentioning earlier hmm. So, their rival? Well, come on, let's clean it up. And judging from their reaction, I'm guessing it's a normal thing. Let's get stuck with the messes. It happens frequently. Gun Sang. Who do you think who do they think they are? Coming in here sword swinging and gun blazing? Welcome. How many are there in your party? Have you seen Soha? You mean that woman who just shot up the place? I can't believe it, but Lady Yahara is letting her stay here. She has a room upstairs. Thanks. Suspicious man. Please enjoy your stay. Characters with eyes like that are never trustworthy. What's it? What's this red and green thing on the map? Is this a Cerulean Order Crimson whatever thing? <laughs> All right. Wow. She really gave her a big ass room. Even has one of those trashy tiger pelts. Carpet. And this bed. Wow. And look at this table. Or is this a desk? Where this is? Do you eat here? Or is it like where you work? And that's it is where you eat. Probably here because there's like chopsticks and this oval thing. I don't know what's it called. All right. Jewel and I had a bit of a misunderstanding before you got here. I picked off a few of her men over at the Raiders' Ark, and she tends to hold grudges. Is Youngwa here? Youngwa's room is across the hall. I'll let you talk to her. She might run if she saw me. I get that a lot. Always keep your hand on your holster. Where's the chance that she's not in here? Really high, I'm assuming. Oh no, she's here. She didn't run. Wow, even her room is pretty nice. It's huge, too. It's like VIP. What the? I'm being attacked. Okay. Wait, I remember you. You're the one who blew my cover in the abandoned shrine. I had a suspicion someone was after me. Have you been following me? Not exactly. Not exactly. Oh, my arm! I'll never challenge you again. What are you doing here anyways? You mean Gil is actually strong? Or is the father and the dad? Huh? Okay. What? The other half of the Naryu Sarasva? Did you get this from Gil? He's a piece of work. I know Yunkai wants the book, but it's written in Naryu. He doesn't read Naryu. If we give it to him now, it would be worthless. That's why we need Lady Yahara. Lady Yahara. What? You don't know who Lady Yahara is? She's the one who runs this place. She also happens to have one of the largest collections of rare manuscripts on the continent. Okay. 
Another cinematic already. Um, is this our... Let me see. Our people, yes. her people. <laughs> did you find it? Yes, I did. <gasps> God, she's so badass. That is so sexy. <laughs> Only a handful of people can read the ancient Naryu text, and she's one of them. With her help, we can use the book to find Mushin's legacy. I'll even split the profits with you. What do you say? Maybe 90-10? No? 80-20? I only need Mushin's legacy to save Sandstone. Really? Well, then, I'm happy to work with you. Yahara is a bit old-fashioned, so perhaps a gift will warm her up to us. Something classy, like gloom sandbiter horns. Trust me, you can get them in the desert. I haven't paid my tab. Maybe the gift will get me out of it. My luck is going to change. Also, this map symbol looks like Mickey Mouse, kind of. Oh, so you get them from these guys, huh? No, oh, this would be easy. Also, I, s I know I keep complaining about it, but I wish you can run with your weapon out or weapon drawn. Like, I'm not sure why is that a not a thing? Unless there's a button to toggle between combat stance and non-combat stance. So, Gapok. Ihara's right hand. Another day, another mess. Greetings. Welcome to the Mirage. You are welcome here as long as you don't disturb the peace. I brought you a gift. A gift? You are most kind. Sandbiter horn makes excellent calligrapher ink. I can use it to decorate my fan. I imagine you would not give me such a gift out of charity. Is there something I can assist you? I have this book. The Naryu Sarazva. Where did you find such a tome? This book is hundreds of years old. The Naryu script is a bit of a challenge, but I shall read what I can. Can this Jian be trusted with such knowledge? When darkness arose, deep, vicious, and wild. The Great Divine Fist completed his trial. He entered the Dark Realm to vanquish and close the Dark Gate of Terror. Oh, the source of our woes. He sacrificed all, gave his life for the realm. Mushin descended, his power remained. Three wise sages locked his light in a tomb, beneath winged skies in a sepulcher womb. Some say the three sages still walk amongst the living. Are you searching for their legacy? I study ancient texts because I believe they are rare treasures in and of themselves. We are all searching for something, Jian. But what I seek is not Mushin's legacy. Where can I seek Mushin's legacy then? Mushin's legacy only brings violence, but to find it, start at the Naryu Temple. All Thank right. you. Hey. So we go tell Yunwa, then she betrays us, or helps us. Watch her not be here. Oh, man, I keep having doubts about this girl. Back so soon? Did she look at the book? So Lady Yahara thinks Mushin's legacy is in a tomb near the Naryu Temple. Well, that's a dead-end venture. The entire area is littered with traps and undead. So, it's not a dead-end. It's just really dangerous. This might be out of our reach. I mean, you're strong and I'm smart, but we would need a small army just to make our way through the entrance. A small army, or maybe a gang of misfits. That's it. Jewel can help us. She's the leader of the Yes Men gang. She's staying at the Mirage, and she's looking for the legacy. Boss Jewel and her Yes Men, they can get us inside. I'll draft a note. Deliver it to Gung Sang. I'll make some arrangements and meet you at the Naryu Temple once Jewel decides to join us. 
Is it? Soha also helping us? I'm pretty sure they won't get along. Let's stick to the plan. Oh, level 33. No, it's not this guy, it's Gung Sing. Oh wait, it's the suspicious guy. What can I do for you? I have a note from Young Wa. Let's see. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, I'll do what it says. Is this the guy who voices Bombak? Oh, I forgot to mention. There was a message for you. Soha sent word for you to meet her at the dry docks. Don't worry, I'll take care of everything. Alright, thank you, suspicious old man. Unless he's like in his 20s or something. Wow. I guess that's why it's called a dry docks. Because it's a dock with dry the water. Probably this whole place used to be filled with water. It's like a giant lake or ocean or a giant body of water is what I'm trying to say. Hmm. Oh, it's Naryu Temple. Like, so Saha, Soha is coming along too. Yanwa beat you here. Looks like she talked Jewel into fighting for her. She's a crafty one. Jewel and I don't exactly get along, so it's probably best if I stay behind. Less of a body count that way. Also, you're a sniper, so having you in the back is pretty good, too. I've tussled with her enough to know she's a good fighter. Stick with her and Yanwa. You'll find what you're looking for. I'll be waiting. Good luck. Used to this gliding thing. Also, why is my screen dark? Another cutscene already. Are you ready? Why do you dress your guys like crabs? Is this Power Rangers? It's like Avatar, the last airbender. Or the Ginyu Force. Isn't it filled with traps? I, I, I guess I'm going in. Hey, you don't see me. I'm just gonna be over here. Everything is great. I got the scavengers to find the Naryu Sarasva. Now I'm using Jewel to get into the Naryu Temple. This is going to help us find Mushroom's legacy. I just know it. And I just know I can't trust you. Come on. Wow, he hits hard. Took like 20% of my health. Oh. I knew those statues looked suspicious. Alright, come alive.
We probably see Jin So Yun here too, probably. What the? Why is Dok Dong here? Oh, if he's one of the three sages, does that mean the Vagabond guy was one? Took you long enough. Didn't expect the handsome country doctor to be one of the three sages, did you? I had my reasons for keeping you in the dark back at Sandstone Refuge. But now you are ready for the truth. I am one of the sages, a keeper of Mu Xin's legacy. The sage's task is to pass Mu Xin's power onto hmm. a worthy descendant. Am I getting a power rope? Oh, I can't wait. I know you seek Mu Xin's legacy. My question is, do you seek it to save the people of Sandstone Refuge or to gain the strength necessary for your revenge? Can the power of the legacy defeat Jin Su Yun? Mu Xin's legacy contains immense power, enough to challenge the Dark Lord himself. A being such as Jin Su Yun would be no match for its strength. I mean, if it has that much power, can't I just do both? You lack control as always. Consider your intentions while you search. Do you seek peace or revenge? Yo, my character is not answering any of his questions. What are these choices? Tell me where it is. It's sounding off like I'm being forceful. I just want the power. That's a little self-centered greedy. How about a riddle instead? At its feet, place gold and silver. With Mushin's blood will life be brought. Unto wings which then will soar high above where Mushin rests. At least you could have made it rhyme. Bro, and he just dipped out of here. No, he's still here. He's just invisible. Unless he's flying. Did you understand any of that? I sure didn't. This is so frustrating. Gold and silver, wings, Mushin's blood. This is giving me a headache. I'm gonna go back to the Mirage to think this over. I mean, it could be the Mirage Tower. Gold and silver. Um, that's really creepy. Is there a curse? What? The, oh, it's the shadow spirits. Come, temptable traitors. That foolish old man. What can we do except stand here and observe? What should we do about these traitors? Mushin, we failed you. Are these like guards to the legacy? Perhaps we can convince an honorable soul to take up our cause. Yo, if it means giving me your outfit, I'm in. The traitor must be punished. Oh, I can't talk to you. As long as the treachery of those Pretenders persist. We are cursed to roam this land. I can't tolerate this. The traitor ruins his shadowless name, and we are powerless to stop them. Hmm. What happened? What did you find? What in the four realms happened in there? The sky went dark, and all these spirits appeared. Dok Dun told me a riddle. Yeah, that sounds like the Naryu. Everything's a damn riddle. I don't know what it means, but I'm sure the Dahlia would. Yonkai's soldiers have spotted them around the Shadow Mist Crypt. Who are the Dahlias? Word is they're a Shadowless faction. Don't know much about the Shadowless, but people say they were Mushin's private army. They protected the Mu family after his death, but later split into factions. Kiron the Red is the leader of the Dahlia. He'd know what the riddle means, but he won't give it up without a fight. Meet me at the Shadow Mist Crypt. Alright. Ooh. Is this better? Crit 10 and HP 3, critical 84. Sounds pretty good to me. The Golden Diva one seems more defensive. Hmm. 
Nice. Oh, looks like we're going back in. Alright, we're at the Shadow Mist Crypt. Here to meet the separated Shadow Less Faction. His private bodyguard. Or was. What the? Bro, they. They have sick outfits. I think just gonna keep disappearing because this is annoying. Easy. What the? You cannot do that right now. Did she get stuck in there? I knew the, the Dahlia were secretive group, but I didn't expect them to attack. Well, that was a bust. Let's go to the Mirage. We can talk about our next move over a few beers. We, we could both use a little time off. Don't you think? Meet you there. Well, I'm gonna keep exploring. at least one of them would drop their outfit maybe okay. oh maybe it's a circle And before they don't even drop their outfit, and you get it from a quest or something. And I'm here doing this for no reason. Unless you get it from the spinning wheel, it could be a thing too. What the? Drum roll says... Nope. If Mushin were alive, he would purge the world of these traitors. Um... No reward? That sucks. Alright. There you are, get over here and have a drink. Why? That sounds really suspicious. We don't even know her that well. I would refuse. I don't accept her drinks from... Well, if I was in this world, I would refuse any drink from someone I do not know that well. Let's see if we get poison. Well, well, well. If it isn't the Hong Moon Adventurer. I hope you don't mind. I started without you. Started, looks like you're almost finished. Oh, I can drink like a Ute. <laughs> Come over here. I want to talk about Master Hong. Just listen to what I gotta say. Please. 
Master Hong was like a father to me. I wanted revenge when my parents died. I wanted the world to pay. But Master showed me that my life, my soul, was more important oh God. than revenge. Is this the point of this is going to be about me letting go of revenge? I mean, she's not wrong. My character has been really up about revenge. Also, she's not really pouring into the cup. It's like spilling out. Which leads me to you. I see it in your eyes. You're on the same path I was on. Well, snap out of it. She shouldn't the master teach you anything. What we're doing to help the people of Sandstone Refuge, that's the path of Hong Moon. Saving people, being good, being... What was I saying? Anyway, you can't travel the path of revenge. You're a fool if you do. You hear me? And I'm here to make sure you don't. Trust me. I'm... I'm... Really shouldn't have had that last one. Ugh. Hmm. Tab. You have acquired a new quest item. Check Soha's tab. Oh, wrong one. Jian, please meet me at my office at your soonest convenience. Okay. And what's this? Participate in the World Martial Arts Tournament. Dual match cling reward. Now nah, I'm good. Ooh, is that money? What's this? Bro, why can't you give me money so I can expand my inventory? Alright. It has come to my attention that you and Soha are friends. Soha has accumulated quite a sizable tab. I was hoping you would pay for it. I am kidding. I brought you here because you spoke to a sage at the Naryu Temple. I am rather curious to know what he told you. Something about silver and gold and Mushin's blood. Interesting. Silver and gold may refer to the Golden Crest and the Silver Crest. It is said that they animate the wings of Mushin, a statue that guards Mushin's tomb. You mentioned Mushin's blood. To my knowledge, only a single heir still lives. That person is now the only one who can open Mushin's tomb. Did the sage mention anything about the whereabouts of Mushin's heir? And that's why we need the compass. I see. Thank you. Knowledge is more precious than gold. I'll consider Soha's tab paid in full. However, your friend Yanwa still hasn't paid for her room and board. Please give her a... F Please give her a friendly reminder. I do have employees to pay. Well, the time is coming up and with that, we'll probably stop for now. We explore a bit, met some shadowless spirit that were part of the guard for the Mush Mushin family. And then they splinter off into separate groups. I'm wondering if that's a quest that's going to come up later where we punch the traitors. But yeah. And the wise man one told us that we have to find the Mushin hair to open the tomb. To seek this power up for revenge. And uh, to help the people of the refuge. Hopefully Lu Sung kills him where we get to. If not, this will be pointless. Soha has also been pretty been pretty cool too. I assumed that she was gonna poison us. I have a lot of doubts about people. But yeah, and the Ginyu force of I've got her name. Uh, I'll write it down when I do the editing. I wonder if she's gonna come back up later or she's only here for that one mission. I know Young was gonna keep popping up into. She gets her treasure or relic, whatever she's looking for, to prove herself. But, anyways, let's continue on next time and see what happens next. See ya.